Item. SCP-203. Object Class. Euclid. Special Containment Procedures. SCP-203 is to be kept in Storage Bunker 3A at Research Facility while powered down. 2D class personnel equipped with sound filtration equipment are required to guard Bunker 3A in case of accidental activation of defense mechanism. While active, SCP-203 is to be accompanied by an armed escort to any testing procedures. Description SCP-203 appears to at one time have been a Caucasian human male of indeterminate age. Subject is two and a half. 2.5 meters tall, though it is theorized that the skeletal framework augments subject's original height, as indicated by irregular musculature, and weighs approximately 200, 200 kilograms. The subject's entire skeletal structure has been removed and replaced with a mechanical framework made of cast iron that seems to move on its own volition. This framework appears to be the sole cause of SCP-203's ambulation, independent of its musculature. Several areas of skin on the subject's body have split, revealing a section of the subcutaneous metal framework 1. In addition to these areas, some parts of the metal structure seem have been made to intentionally protrude from the flesh, seeming to form an aesthetic pattern 2. The augmentations to the subject's body include, but are not limited to, the fingers have been extended into sharpened barbs approximately 1, 1, meter long. The lips have been removed, revealing that SCP-203 lacks a jawbone, suggesting that the skull is a single, hollow piece. Remaining oral tissue has been tied into the skull with several hook-like protrusions. In place of the mouth, a small, audio transducer-like grate has been welded. This augment produces basic vocalizations through an unknown mechanism. The vertebrae have been replaced with a segmented iron bar, which has several sharp barbs haphazardly welded to it. The legs have two added joints, making them appear functionally digitigrade, with steel tubes of an unknown function protruding from them executing and tying into the back. The ribcage lacks a sternum, causing the skin to pull inward with contraction of the subject's diaphragm. Ears removed, remaining skin stapled together 3. Expunged, removed. All toes removed, replaced with a solid piece of iron, vaguely resembling the metal insert of a steel toe boot. The heels are augmented with similar metal inserts. Eyes have been retained, but are held in the forward-facing position by several needles protruding from the eye socket. Irises seem to be permanently dilated and not photoreactive. While lacking vocal cords, SCP-203 can communicate verbally through the transducer located on its faciplet. It appears to understand English to an extent, but its primary language appears to be a previously unknown Arabic dialect. SCP-203 has no recollection of a life before its augmentations, only that it feels near constant pain and confusion. SCP-203 appears to run on an internal power cell that runs for a 72-hour period, after which the subject enters into a state of hibernation that lasts between 3 and 4 hours. Subject cannot deliberately deactivate this power source though it has expressed that these periods of sleep are the only escape it has from its otherwise miserable existence, as there is no current way of ascertaining the truthfulness of the subject's statements. Any expression of pain or depression by the subject is to be viewed by staff as a method of eliciting a sympathetic response, and are to be dismissed. X-rays, CT, ultrasound and all other forms of diagnostic imagery 4 have proven incapable of penetrating the internal workings of SCP-203 deeper than the subcutaneous level, and exploratory surgery activates a secondary defense mechanism that, redacted, 
It has recently come to light that SCP-203 has the ability to emit a high-frequency drone, superficially similar to audio feedback, that has a severely damaging effect on the human nervous system. However, this mechanism is only activated when subject is provoked or harmed. For more information regarding this ability, see the attached testing log. SCP-203 has, on numerous occasions, requested either anesthetics, analgesics or on occasion, narcotics. These requests are pending approval.